Oh, I want to now this tell to you the story. I have um, so yes, go to the um, market, the um, store, the food store, and on the side of the of the door of the food store, there was one a fishing. Uh, car you know so car it sells uh, fish um, I immediately so I like to do a lot of the time go to them and try to let them feel dirty for the things that I do I go to that fish tra trash bags and I go to stand before them and ask them how then exactly the question how will you feel if there the fish put you in the sea and then I start further with um, asking the question I actually I make an analogy on where I told you how will you uh, how feel you if uh, you've been hunger you walk along, along fast and you see an apple tree and then when you yes you feel hunger a little bit and you go to that apple tree and then go with your hands to the apple tree and then the apple tree put a metal hook between you in your hand in your hands and Put you high in the sky to a place where you not can breathe. We um, kill fish on the same way. That we drown fish the same way that we are drowned in there. This asshole, honestly, just like any oppressor. That I've ever talked with. Go in the defense mode. Oh, but, but the human life you have won. Yes, 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 yes. And don't want to wear it. Because he is a little bit an annoying recant. There's also something that any oppressor ever there does. Always say, oh, no, no, uh, yes, 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 yes. If, if I don't know the answer. Then this man tried to intimidate me. By stepping out of this fish trash bag car and he stand wants to stand before me and try to intimidate me uh, by try to stop me with uh, told him how bad his career are been. And to now, when to uh, in this moment, I say that I have the rights according to the, the human rights law, Article 10, part uh, Arti Alinea 4, that I have the right to say them what you what uh, that I can say what I want, and that they have to prove me that they are. But I don't have right, be right by any means necessary. That stands in the the human rights. You have the right to say anything, and they have to prove prove it. Also, don't mean right. So there's not a justification to say anything that you like to say, even be bullshit. But it isn't justification for human for animal rights activists to arrest technically the animal abusers because there stands ne that you have to ne by necessary if it be necessary you have to arrest you don't have to respect them. According to the human rights law, if they do something wrong, if you accuse, if you see that they do something wrong, 
they even deem it, ex deem it acceptable, technically. So, this is what I have to say. The man comes back in his truck and he become a little bit annoying because he don't have uh, anything to say. And then I put that fact up that actually the seas, in contrast with what most people believe, not the rainforest being responsible for a lot of our accidents. Actually, that's been the sea. Uh, something like 70% of all the accidents comes from the sea. And that is a lot of accidents. It comes from plankton. Actually, plankton do it the wheels put in the sky between. It, um, Whales put in the light zone of the sea by swimming from the lower part to the higher part of the sea. That's actually how the, the photon saw. And then I say, if you don't want to believe me, I say you. Check the site of uh, sea shepherds. If you not want to believe me, I have. I speak the truth. I don't. Under, I don't know if they actually believe me in this part, but I still speak the truth. Do not believe me. Choose yourself then. The site of the um, sea shepherds. Check me. Actually, also then I say. The victim is nothing to defend. The fendel don't care what any other victim thinks. The victims aren't changeable. It is not your right if somebody else fish being allowed uh, also something that I have to say. Between the first and the and the three lines. Um that fish actually in contrast with what most people believe. The fish industry is respons is uh, also responsible and, and yes in contrast what most people believe a uh, fish be not stupid fish experience a lot of different emotions They're being not stupid, that's all propaganda from the fierce industry. And then I also say, I try to explain this brainwashed freak camps that the fish industry go with big trainers over the bottom of the sea, take any life form with them and also try to eliminate a lot of endangered species like dolphins and whales and other animals that have been drowned in this big trend or nets that is what it been actually they're killing the oceans a lot of them a lot of this stuff would been in this rounders nets, strangers nets, or how you want to call them. I like to call them rounder nets. Um, this animals being then, then they mean actually called bycatch, and that can be actually. Mostly any sea animal, and that's been feed to the pigs and, and uh, cows. That's been also not on this planet for human consumption. They've been just like you dogs and you cats, been not on this planet for human consumption. You don't need animal products to survive. I've been vegan for something like. 
12 years. I don't lose actually supplements, not a lot, not actually. And I have no deficiency. Sometimes a little bit, maybe too little vitamin D, but it's not the problem of that. It's just because I don't come a lot in the sun and I want to look like a vampire. Sometimes a fruit vampire. A fruity, fruity vampire. I hope that one of them uh, go to the side of Sea Shepherd and see how horrible that be. But it's not only them, it's also you. If you support the meat, dairy, and egg, fish, animal exploitation industry, the scumbags, you're being directly responsible for billions and billions of innocent lives. Maybe I've been harsh and controversial to you. But that don't mean that I've been not right. And maybe you think that I've been a bully. But maybe you've been the bully. I understand you don't see yourself like a criminal. But that don't mean that you don't be a criminal. Injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. Humans have not the right to take any in their life form. Only for their selfish privilege, beliefs and habits. It is not your right, based on your traditions, your beliefs and your habits, to ignore animals their freedom so that you can harm them, slave them, rape them, exploit them, uh, use them like objects and entertainment. That's not what rights are about. That's injustice. There is no counter argument against veganism. We have replacements for any of these things. It is 2016. Awaken. It is not funny. It is not cute. It have to stop. You have to take responsibility for our evil actions. There's not the time anymore that we have ex that we can make excuses for our evil behavior of our cult, of their cultists, of their society, of their matrix, when darkness and light become one, become one. The reality splinter away and the true become visible. Cut the fire up. Do not to other living beings that you don't want the dare do to you. And give compassion to other living beings that don't but think you that you have the right to decide the life of another creature. How feel you if we do the same things to you? Will you pay somebody else to do to another? Then you'll be nothing better than somebody that pay somebody else to murder somebody else that's injustice so no excuse breaking down them had human beings if i have i have if i have created them i put my hat in a sack from shit Why always protect the wrong kinds of your psychopathic species? Why embrace all human stupidity and stand to eliminate the bad kinds, of the satics, the wrong, the evil kinds of humanity? Make yourself a better person and stand to make yourself a worse parasite.
doctors know doubt would be true and would be not. Compassion to the violence of life is a force for good. And violent destruction of life is a force for evil.